So Jay, two on the slate, you What's your initial assessment of that? Um, sounds a little bit crazy because we lost the game, but I thought there was plenty of positives. Uh, I thought we started the game ever so well. Um, and then obviously that, that first goal was a blow. I, th I felt it was a foul. Personally, I thought it was a high foot on Will De Havilland. All six foot four, and the bloke takes it with his foot off his forehead. So for me, that's a, that's a high foot, but the ref seemed to not think so, even though the fourth official did. And I think that really sort of killed us a little bit. Um, but there was lots of positives tonight. I thought we played some really good stuff, played some good attacking football. Um, probably needed, needed that goal a little bit earlier. And maybe it's a different outcome. But um, even when we were 2 0 down, you could see the boys kept going. And unfortunately, we got this, probably got our goal a little bit too late. So you think the first goal was a foul, frustrating uh, second goal to concede as well? Yeah, the second goal, I just think Jordan gets caught up in a little bit of a fight three yards out. And I don't know, I'd have to see it again, but I, I think we deal with that a little bit better. It's a good delivery in our box, they, they, they do rip him a great ball. Um, but like I say, listen, there was plenty of positives. Obviously, we haven't won the game, so it's not ideal, but all in all, we played some good stuff. Um, I thought the shape of the team was good. Even when we went to 4 4 2, it still worked, and, and I thought for large parts we were, we were on top. I mean, other than the, the, the couple of goals, I don't remember them causing us lots of problems. Um, but yeah, we maybe need to, be, need, need to be a little bit more clinical and maybe in both boxes be, be slightly better to win games. I was going to say, do you think we seem to be able to keep possession quite well, but when it gets to the final third, it seems to break down a little bit? Yeah, a little bit at times, and we said that. I think the one real bit of quality was Andre's cross, um, and it's a great header. Uh, I thought we got into good areas. Jamar, I thought we should have a penalty for handball with Jamar's shot. Um, personally, I thought it was a blatant handball. Again, the refs, the refs thought otherwise, but we got in some good areas, put some good balls in the box, and maybe on another day you score a couple, but... Like I said the other week, we're a young side, we're still, we're still learning a little bit about each other and, um, and we'll get that. So obviously Finney was on the uh, team sheet today but he didn't play, can you just tell us what happened there? Yeah, he pulled out, he did the full warm-up coming as we were coming out, he had his shirt on and then said his groin was tight. So disappointed to lose, I think obviously Jordan coming in did OK, um, but it's difficult, uh, you, you warm up, but I suppose mentally you're not as, as switched on as, as if you're going to start a game. So, um, But yeah, it's disappointing to lose Finney, uh, obviously it's, it's been settled back for, but we seem to have late, Jordan's had to keep filling in there and to be honest with you, he'll probably end up getting a run in there and, and probably deserves it. Was the groin uh, what trouble Finney on Saturday? No, that was a knee issue, but he's had this groin for a couple of weeks where it's just been tight after pre-season. But like I say, hopefully it won't be too long. Uh, but I'm, I'm quite happy with Jordan and Will there and we can work with him this week preparing for Saturday. And lastly, anything in particular you look to work on on Thursday and Friday at training? I think end product in the final third. Uh, you always, you always want to add to that. Um, and, and just preparing really for, 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 um, for Saturday. Barrow, good side, I've watched their last two games because they played Halifax to watch that one and they played Lone Orient. So they're, they're a good football inside, changed a lot from what they've been recently. So it'd be a tough test for us. But um, as I said to the boys, I honestly believe if we get around them levels and we were tonight, we won't be far away. We just by cutting out silly little mistakes.